this is Swiss darning or duplicate stitch. The chart encompasses the section in between our garter stitch border. The first stitch that we're going to duplicate is on row five. It's nine stitches in. One, two, three, four. And I've just sat my needle there on row five. I'm going to make a stitch that covers this little V here, the two legs of the stitch. I'm going to bring my yarn needle up at the bottom of that stitch. Then I'm going to take the needle and I'm going to slide it between the two legs of the stitch above and pull. To cover this left hand leg, I'm going to put my needle straight back in at the bottom of the stitch, which is where we came in, and pull through. Look at that. So sew in your ends and then you'll be ready to make as many more of these squares as you need, ready to sew them all together at the end.